Hello, my friends. This is Video Lancer. Recently, we have updated our extension Motion Bro up to the third version. In this video, I will tell you what we have added and will show you how to use the new version of the extension. I suppose the most important thing in this new version is that now Motion Bro works not only in After Effects, but also in Premiere Pro. But I will tell you about the peculiarities of using the extension for Premiere Pro in another video review. In this review, I will show you how to use the third version of Motion Bro for After Effects. So let's start. Primarily, create a folder where all packages for Motion Bro will be stored. Move all the folders with presets here for all the packages that you have. In the future, if you get other packages for Motion Bro, just extract them to this folder and they will be available on the extension panel. To install any extension for Adobe applications, we recommend to use ZXP Installer. You can download it for free at zxpinstaller.com. So download ZXP Installer that complies with your operating system and install it. Download the Motion Bro extension at our site, motionbro.net. Extract the ZXP file from the zip archive. Run ZXP Installer. Drop the ZXP into the installer window and wait for the installation to complete. Now run After Effects and go to Window, Extensions, Motion Bro 3. When the extension is started for the first time, you should indicate the way to the folder where all the packages for Motion Bro are stored. Indicate the folder that you have created before. The extension has found the available packages and now you should enter the purchase codes for them. You can find this code in your email in the message with the purchase confirmation from the market. So, presets packages are installed. You can choose the presets packages in this tab. All the categories of the chosen package are displayed in this block. All the presets for the chosen category are displayed here. To see the preset review, just hover the cursor on the thumbnail. You can choose two modes for preview in the settings of Motion Bro. Here you can increase and decrease the size of thumbnails. To apply the preset, select the Active Composition and click Apply for the picked preset. The preset will be added into your composition by time indicator. If any layer is selected in your composition, the preset will be added on this layer. To replace the added preset quickly, select it in the Active Composition and apply a new preset while holding the Control key. To customize the added preset, open the composition of the preset and change all the available items here. To change the text, just edit text layers. To use your photos and videos in the scenes, open a similar placeholder and insert your media here. Other settings are usually located on Settings layer. Every package of presets contains additional tools for presets customization. There can be different sets of tools depending on the package. For example, there is one set of tools for the package with seamless transitions, and there is another one for AE Face tools. To understand how the tools work for the certain package, you can see additional information at the page with the description of this product. In this video review, I will show only common tools that are standard for all packages. In the previous version of Motion Bro, if you added some similar scenes in your project, 
you had to change the color scheme for every added scene. We have simplified this task in the new version. Now it's enough to change settings in one master scene, and these settings will be linked for all the other scenes. So select all the scenes in the active composition for which parameters should be linked. Do the action Link with Master Scene. Select the composition here that will be used as a master scene. This composition will be marked by prefix Master. Open Master Composition and adjust Color Scheme as you please. These changes will be repeated for all the linked scenes. While you are picking presets, a lot of them can be stored up in your project, but not used anywhere else. Do the action Delete Unused Comps to delete all the unnecessary items and thus to optimize your project. Well, in this video, I have shown the basic review for Motion Bro extension. More detailed information can be found in our help center on the site motionbro.net. Subscribe to my channel not to miss the review of MotionBro version for Premiere Pro. That was Video Lancer. See you.